Assalamu alaikum and salam sejahtera to all my students. Today, we go to topic 2, Equation, Inequalities and Absolute Value, Part 1. For the lecture 1 of 4, subtopic 2.1, Equation. So, our objective for this session, at the end of the lesson, students should be able to find the equation involving indices, search, and logarithm. Okay, firstly, we go to equation. Try to understand the meaning of the an equation is a mathematical statement that states two algebraic expression are equal. Some example in one variable are Okay, now we try to focus to index equation. There are three methods to solving index equation. First one, log of both sides of the equation. Second one, compare base and index of term on left-hand side and right-hand side. And third method is substitution. Now we go to example one. We try to solve the equation for a 7 power of x plus 1 equal to 12. This is the index equation. We try to compare left and right. On left and right hand side, base 7. On the right hand side, base 12. Because we have a different base on the left and on the right hand side, therefore, the method is log of both sides of the equation. So we try to put log 7 power of x plus 1 equal to log 12. Next, we try to apply a rule of log. We try to using power rule. What we want to do is we try to bring x power of 1 in front of log 7. Therefore, we can simplify this equation become x plus 1 equal to log 12 divided by log 7. So lastly, after you simplify, you can got x equal to 0 0.277. Next, we go to the second example, b. Okay, the question is 27 power of x plus 1 equal to 9 power of x minus 1. Firstly, we try to switch to the lowest base. On the left hand side, 27, we can change to 3 power of 3 bracket power of x plus 1. And on the right hand side, we can change base 9 become 3 power of 2 bracket power of x minus 1. So, we try to expand 3 power of 3 times 2 x plus 1, we got 3 power of 3 x plus 3 and the right hand side we try to expand the power you got 3 power of 2 x minus 2 okay, next we try to using the method compare base and index on term on left hand side and right hand side because now we already simplified until you got base 3 on left and base 3 on right Therefore, we can compare the power of indices. So, therefore, we can got 3x plus 3 equal to 2x minus 2. After that, we try to simplify. Lastly, we got x equal to negative 5. Okay, now we go to the example 2. Solve the equation e power of 2x minus 3 e power of x plus 2 equal to 0. For this equation, index equation, we try to use in the method 3. Method 3 is substitution. Firstly, we try to let e power of x equal to u. Next, you substitute e power of x equal to u to the equation. Therefore, you can got quadratic equation in terms of u u power of 2 minus 3u plus 2 equal to 0. Next, for this 
quadratic equation we try to factorize so therefore you can got u minus 2 bracket u minus 1 equal to 0 therefore you can got the value of u equal to 2 and 1 to find out the value of x therefore we must to substitute u as a e power of x therefore you can got to equation e power of x equal to 2 and e power of x equal to 1 so to solve this equation so what you want to do we try to compare left and right because we have different base on the left hand side we we have a base e on the right hand side we have base 2 same like this one left hand side base e right hand side base 1 therefore because different base we try to put log both sides but now we try to using log base e we can write down as a ln so we put ln both sides therefore you can got ln e power of x equal to ln 2 and the second one ln e power of x equal to ln 1 okay to simplify this equation to find out x therefore we try to apply rule of law we try to using power rule okay so what you want to do the power of x we can bring in front like this x ln e equal to ln 2 therefore and as we know ln e equal to 1 therefore you can go lastly after simplifying x equal to ln 2 and for the second one you can got x equal to 0 why you got x equal to 0 because ln 1 equal to 0 therefore for final answer first you must to check the both uh, answer and substitute to the original equation to make sure this answer satisfied to this equation Okay, I think that's all for today. Thank you.